Today we are going to talk about the notion of technology enhanced learning. What is it that we are enhancing? How do we enhance? And why do we enhance? As a term, technology enhanced learning is more European uh, driven term and it's been widely used and employed in the context of uh, educational technologies or e-learning or online learning. There are different terms that are used in the field of uh, uh, use of uh, ICT tools in education. And um, uh, one thing that we need to understand how it relates to pedagogy the term pedagogy has been defined in the various ways, including the art of teaching, the science of teaching, the craft of teaching, the profession of teaching, or just another word for practice in teaching. Since in Greek, agogos means a leader, and the pedagogos was a slave who led boys to school and back, but also taught them manners and tutored them after school. And then this term uh, simply became to mean a teacher. The word pedagogy, it's widely used and means teaching. So how does technology and what is technology and how does it relate to pedagogy and teaching? Technology, if we look up in the uh, uh, Google, uh, is an application of specific knowledge for practical purposes, especially in the industry. Machinery equipment developed from the application of scientific knowledge and the brand of knowledge dealing with engineering on applied sciences. So technology can be something that has to do with conceptual innovations or t can be tangible or intangible. It's coming from the Greek word techne art, craft. So, in the neuro sense, so technology can refer to a particular set of concepts and procedures within a field. Digital technology with the field of communication, cold forging technology within the field of metal processing, etc. Some examples of technology are electronic media, such as video, computers, discs, lasers, there are different types of pedagogy and there can be tangible. How to use technology in education? I would like you to take a look at this picture and think about uh, what it can mean. This is a futuristic view of how the learning would happen in the year 2000. Basically, here we have a case of transmission and knowledge transmission uh, content transmission into the heads of uh, students directly as teachers of university professors. I don't think that this is the case you believe we can transmit knowledge. So how do we actually use technology? What is the birth of this field? Um, this century that we live in and the previous century is actually the century of inventing new tools for education and these new tools for education have been invented it's it's a very new field the first technology that has been invented for education hasn't been the alphabet or the writing system Ironically, those were invented for bureaucratic purposes, for bookkeeping. The first technology for education that was in, uh, invented for the purposes of teaching and learning has been the chalk and the blackboard. It's a very <laughs> surprising uh, thing, probably, but a tool, a technological tool, can be something that doesn't have to do exactly with digital technology. So, for, for the next meeting, I'm going to talk about the digital technological context, how digital technologies can enhance or what are they supposed to do.